A community is honoring a teacher's memory by carrying out her message of faith. Beth Denman died in a car crash on Kentucky 11 in Clay County back in March. As our Marcus Conroy shows us, her death is inspiring the community to continue supporting the causes she was passionate about. Beth Denman was killed on March 11th in a car accident with a suspected drunk driver who was also killed. Her parents still struggle with the loss. Take it day by day. Take it day by day and with trust in God. And the prayers, the prayers of people have uplifted us so much. The loss was so great. It's, it's really hard to describe it. It felt like losing a family member. Denman was not only a teacher at Laurel County's Bush Elementary, she was a former drug addict. When she was not teaching, she was devoting her time to three passions, drug rehabilitation, helping young pregnant women, and education. And every day it seems like we hear a story of some life that she's touched. Either they tell us themselves or somebody else tells us, and it just, we just are so grateful. The Foundation Beth's Blessings was started after her death to help raise money for those passions. Hundreds gathered on Sunday for gospel music, food, music, and stories about how Denman has touched their lives even after her death. Our hearts will, there's a, there's a void there, but I've seen so many good things come out of our loss of bed. Denman's parents wish they had their daughter back, but are thankful and humbled by all the support from the community. It's just so awesome, her friends, and I'll call them family, her family at school and everywhere, everywhere. Everyone here serves as a reminder that Beth Denman will live on. In Laurel County, Marcus Conroy, WKYT 27 News First. In just two months, Beth's Blessings has raised more than $20,000.